Kev just showed up with the party supplies. Wanna lend a hand with decorating? Sure, how can I say no to streamers? Hiya, boss. This is really great. Now's not the best time to talk about that. Do you think we have enough crate paper? Come again? Crate paper. Do we have enough? <clears throat> it's crepe paper with a P. Really? Yeah, really. Sorry, folks. Party's over. Who the fuck are you? Chet Drummond, Marshal General Counsel. The Saints are now a wholly owned subsidiary of Marshal Defense Industries. Ha! Uh, no. The employment agreement you signed when we hired you contained a non-compete clause. I signed a lot of shit. I didn't actually read it. Not our problem. By attacking martial interests, to wit, the Frontier Prison, our cargo train, and various other assets, you became a competitor. So, what's your fucking point? Pursuant to Article 9, Section 12, Paragraph 36A, you have surrendered all rights and ownership of the Saints to us. Eli? Oh my god, he's right. Of course I'm right. I wrote the fine print myself. You are aware that didn't solve the issue, right? Yeah, but he was being a dick. Atticus thinks we're gonna roll over while he takes what we built? Fuck that. I'm declaring all out war on that asshole. Hell yeah! It's a revolution! I'll rally the troops. Tell everyone to meet us there. You know Marshall won't fight this kind of war. They'll fight a war of red tape. You need to think this out. I have thought it out. I'm going to fucking kill Atticus. Saw that coming. But that won't solve our problem. It'll solve my anger. This is a binding legal document. You can't just shoot your way through it. Maybe we try using our words this time. Fine, I'll call Atticus and tell him why I'm gonna fucking kill him. A step in the right direction. <laughs> You have called Marshall Defense Industries. Please listen to the menu options as they have recently changed. Ugh, what do I press to speak to a person? For customer service, press 1. For billing, press 2. For the complaints department, press 3. Finally. All of our operators are currently busy. To leave a callback number, press 1. To leave a message, press 2. To leave a death threat, press three. Fuck you, three. Sorry, that inbox is full. Goodbye. See, try words. Back to murder. Murder can't solve everything. You shut your mouth. I'm just saying we'll need to use our heads to get out of this one. This is more complicated than our usual shit. Look, let's just kill Atticus first so everyone can calm down and then you can think of a real solution. Sounds like a win-win. You know, except for Atticus. But fuck him. Am I right? Wow, you know you two are being enablers right now. Looks like the gang's all here. You're gonna ruin your entire life! Yes. Alright. Ah! Hold here! Leo, just give me one second!
down! Damn it! We're here. Let's bust in and make our way to the top floor. That's where Shithead's office is. Bring me at it! You son of a bitch, come down here and fight me! Much as I love to see Atticus fight his own battles, that is not a stop. Let me take the elevator straight to him. I'm moving in. Uh, you give us our criminal empire back! I'll stay here with the crew and hold off any reinforcements. Copy that. Stay safe. I don't know what to do to Atticus first. Punch him in the face or kneecap him. You could just shoot him. Nah, I want to draw this out. Make him feel it, you know? Curb stomping? Kind of a pain to haul him outside. None of that will help our cause. You know that, right? Then what will? We could tie it up in court. In court? We're criminals. Not in Marshall's books. I'm sure they'll list us as a corporate acquisition. Play it right and we could drag this out for years. We're not waiting years. Except for this fucking elevator. Seriously, what the fuck? What happened? Why'd we stop? Security lockdown. We're on foot from here. Welcome to Marshall Defense Industries. What may I help? This will hurt you more than me. Uh, that's right. See, won't take us years to get through it this way. We're not actually getting through. <sighs> Welcome to Marshall Hugo. Shit, it's a trap. The sniper's on the upper floor. I should snipe him back. You're just asking for an ass whipping. Fuck, those snipers are pinning us down. Make sure no one follows you. Hey, if you get any downtime, search the legal files for documents on the acquisition. Welcome to Marshall Research and Development. <laughs> Key card required. Damn, it's locked. Looks like this elevator's the only way up. So let's go. Check the desks. Someone always leaves their key card at work. Why can't I just shoot it? That's not how it works! I told you, you can't just shoot your way through all your problems! No, oh, fine. No key card here.
Not seeing a key card. There is an incoming call from Atticus Marshall. So, did you really think you could just waltz into my building and take your little saints back? <laughs> this assault is nothing more than a temper tantrum. You go ahead. Shoot whomever you like. I'll rehire. Destroy the whole fucking building. I'll rebuild. And it won't change a thing. I'll still own you, because I have more lawyers than you have bullets. In the end, I will win. I will always win. Nothing here either. This guy has a key card. See? I told you so. You told me I'd find one in a desk. I had to murder this guy to get it. I guess we're both right. Shall we go? Welcome to the Marshal Executive Floor. Intruders located. Putting them down. Oh? Shit. <laughs> You'll regret that. Smells like privilege in here. Shoot the back. Ready for Atticus's last stand? You go on. I'll see if I can find anything useful in here. Suit yourself. I'm coming, motherfucker. You son of a bitch! Wait, Myra Star? Didn't take you long to get up here. 
You are a plucky one. Where's Atticus? Oh, he turned tail and flew away the second you entered the lobby. I told him this whole saints business would bite us in the ass, but he never listens. Then give us back the saints. As chair of the board, I could. Only problem is Atticus holds that title. That man has been a bee in my bonnet for a long time. How about we help each other out? Fine. Tell me where he is and I'll kill him. Now, not so fast. You kill Atticus and his seat on the board will pass to his next of kin, who won't help you. Well, then I'll kill them too. And then their kin, and then theirs. The Marshall family is large and ornery. They'll never help you. But you help me vote him off the board, and I'll scratch your back real good. So... how do we do that? If you make Atticus look bad enough, our company's stock price will tank. Shareholders will panic, and the board will have no choice but to change leadership. That's when I'll take over and give the Saints back to you. All right. You got yourself a deal. <laughs>